Remove the power from the 6712. Open the pump band latch and rotate the band out of the way. Loosen the liquid detector cover thumb screw. Pull the pump tubing off of the bulkhead fitting and pull the pump tubing out of the sampler head. Remove any silicone deposits from the pump rollers or pump band. Replacement tubing for models 5800, 6712, and Avalanche come in packages of pre-cut tube bundles. Insert the new pump tubing into the sampler head, making sure that the blue band closest to the end of the new pump tube fits into the groove for connection to the suction line. Connect the discharge side of the pump tubing to the bulkhead fitting on the center section. Close the liquid detector cover, hand tighten the thumb screw, and re-secure the pump band latch. Reapply power. To test the pump operation on the new tube, press the 1 button on the control panel to run the pump in reverse direction and press enter. Press the red stop key to stop the pump. Next, press the number 3 button followed by enter to run the pump in the forward direction. Then press the red stop key to stop the pump. To reset the tubing counter, press the down arrow key to get other functions blinking and press enter. With maintenance selected, press enter. Use the arrow keys to select pump tube alarm and press enter. The current pump counts limit is displayed. Press enter, then select yes to reset the pump counter. Then press enter two more times, followed by the red stop key to finalize the reset. Pump tube replacement is now complete.